Welcome, this is the energy vibration a reading for all Sun, Moon, and Rising um, Aquarians for the third week of July 2017. And it is the week of the hair, so it's going to be a wonderful, positive week for you, Aquarians. It's going to be a really positive week if you're having situation with legalities and that sort of a thing. It's going to be justified, it's going to be wonderful. Um, this is a week that begins with water and it ends on Sunday with the energy of fire because the zodiac energy will change. It is the end of uh, um, a wonderful time for the water energies, the emotional energies. So from Monday until Saturday, it will be a little bit emotional, but for the rest of the week, it's going to be okay, which is Sunday. What is happening is here is that you're moving away from something. This is your focus, the six of sword. This is wonderful. It's a very productive energy and it's really supporting you guys. So this is wonderful. You're using the energy of you. Um, you know, you're ready out of whatever situation it was. So whatever situation that you have been dealing with, you are out of it because it's the energy of, of a reversal so you or have you have justice and you're moving away you're walking away from something that doesn't serve you anymore this is um, a wonderful week because what I'm seeing here I'm seeing the energy of temperance which is the hurt you're having the hurt energy you're having the uh, the Pentacles which is uh, extremely good and other energies that you're having is the energy of the world in the, the middle of the week, so a lot of good things are happening for you, Aquarians. Then you have the clava of the pentacles, so money is coming in, and you have the clava of the one. So a situation over money is coming up, and you have the four of cups. The four of cups is uh, that you're looking, you're feeling bored, and that sort of a thing, but you're looking for something, and you have the energy of the devil. So be aware of what is ever is happening on. Sunday because the energy of the devil is here so okay let's see what is happening for you guys um, the energy is a lot of ones ones energy ones energy as a lot of ones energy because you have the energy of uh, the ace of Pentacles uh, the clave of Pentacles uh, the clave of ones um, four of cups is always you know you're thinking planning your next move let's see what is happening for you Aquarius it's going to be wonderful whatever is happening for you Aquarius it's all about business in this week celebration business and celebration so the devil you have the devil doesn't have an effect on you the devil doesn't have an effect on you guys okay we're going to break down the week and see the number one energies here tens 10 you have the 10 of one but yet still the 10 of swords um they're all in the reverse form so whatever burden you have it's leaving um whatever stabbing in the back that is also leaving and that is with the energy of the devil so you know on friday there's going to be a celebration because good news will be coming into you on Friday which is a three of cups which is extremely good you have the two of ones you have the 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 the, the, the ace of one so you know there is so much new beginning new possibilities that are coming in your life okay as we look at Monday we have the energy of uh, um, temperance this energy of temperance is a wonderful wonderful energy of temperance because what is happening is that you need to find balance it's an earth energy vibration and this is somebody who is going to connect with you is who is of a, 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 a Virgo person and she's going to learn and teach you balance but yet still you're standing there with your sword up and you're standing there with your words up and that sort of a thing but have balance whoever this person is have balance whatever she is saying you know just have balance you don't have to really get involved and get uh, um, all connected with this person because sometimes listen to the message and not to who is giving it and you are giving this message towards this Virgo but be aware of what you know what you're doing because uh, sometimes things can come back to bite you okay as we look at Tuesday another hurt energy vibration another wonderful day the ace of Pentacles is here and the ace of Pentacles is bringing you a new life with your financial situation so whatever is happening new life with money new life with business situation that sort of a thing is going to come if there was situation that was um, blocking you of that sort of a thing 
uh, you know the ace of pentacles is always whenever you are feeling that energy vibration you're feeling good your financial is flowing your financial security the ace of pentacles bring you a new financial security that is going to be extremely positive for you guys so this is going to be good i'm loving the energies for you guys as we look in the middle of the week another earth energy the world so this is just going to be wonderful so you have temperance you know from Monday until Wednesday it is all earth energies until Thursday it is all earth energy so this is wonderful because what is happening is that you have the energy of the world and whatever that was blocking you whatever burden that you were carrying has come to an end and you're going to see wonderful new endeavors happening into your life in this week it's going to be it's a positive positive week so whoever you you are out there and you have been carrying a burden the burden is now over it's in the reverse form and good things are about to happen you have the energy of the Knight of Pentacles. The Knight of Pentacles is the energy vibration of um, someone coming with a message. It's, it's, it's money coming, but very slowly. Um, new opportunities, no doors of opportunities are going to be opening for you. So this is going to be wonderful. So this Knight of Pentacles is bringing information and bringing um, wonderful possibilities into your life. So if you're looking for work you are going to meet someone who is of a, a Taurus a Virgo or a Capricorn and this man is going to open up doors of opportunities for you and this is going to be good no matter what it is and where you are this person is going to bring in wonderful possibilities of uh, new beginnings um, work and that sort of a thing for you as we look at Friday a very good day which is a fire day so you have the energy of earth from Monday to Thursday and on Friday you have the energy of fire but this is good news coming into you and this good news on Friday is going to bring in celebrations for you guys so good news and it's going to be a time of celebration what I also want to say is that maybe some of you are going to connect with someone who is of a fire sign and they, he is going to bring you something that you're going to be celebrated with so this can affect the people who between the ages of 18 and 35 so be aware for this open up for the energies it's going to be a good day to go out if you're looking for someone go out if you're looking for someone and you might meet someone who's going to connect with you okay as we look at Saturday we have the energy of the four of cups this four of cups is actually a wonderful energy because each card deck give off different sort of energy this four of cups is a wonderful energy because what it is doing it is that it is bringing you to a place that you are going to plan and with this new plan you're going to be successful with whatever you're thinking about doing whatever plan you're trying to bring up it's going to be extremely successful because you have the energy vibration of uh, being a success this this whatever it is especially for you women it's going to be a success whatever you're planning it's going to be a huge success so go for it go for it because your energy vibration is here and it's as if you are standing up and you're saying this is what I want because you take the time this is what I want and this is what I am going to bring in my life the devil I actually like this devil <laughs> and it, it is the energy of the devil on Sunday and I can understand why because the energy of the fire sign begins because the Leos begin their birthdays on um, Sunday so with the energy of Sunday it's with the devil it's it's, it's going to be something where whatever that so you know the stabbing of the back and whatever people were lying about and this sort of a thing it's going to finally come to an end okay it's going to really finally come to an end so do not be alarmed with the energy of this devil I actually like the energy of this devil and what it's bringing in is that all the conflicts and all the things uh, all the chaos all the lies and things that people were saying it's going to come to an end and with this coming to an end you're going to see a very very positive endeavor in your life and this is going to be extremely good as I break down the week and I'm looking at the week for the first half of the week it's all about uh, um, new things work and money success is coming in being justified if you have a lawsuit you're going to hear in the middle in the, in the beginning of the week that you have won this lawsuit and you're going to be um, it's a good it's a huge win and it's a great win 
and this is the new life new success new things are coming in your life because there is balance coming in so whatever you have a new endeavor if you have a new business where people who have new business of people who wants to go and start the energy of your business being a success it's going to be a success it's saying here okay and whoever that is a, a, a Taurus a Virgo or a Capricorn this person is going to come in and somehow help you and open up certain aspect of yourself and certain situations of yourself that is going to bring you to a place where you're going to feel as if everything is falling in place and I should I should show you what is happening here because you have temperance and then you have the ten of pentacles, the ace of pentacles. Okay, and these two together um, is good because uh, then you have the four of cups. So there is a planning because there is a new beginning happening, and these new beginning with these two, you know, even the four of cups because this is a deck which is such a positive deck. I love this deck. I love working with this deck. What you're seeing, the ace of pentacles, and you're seeing here that you're having temperance with you whatever your financial situation is and it's going to be a, a good um, endeavor because whatsoever you are planning is going to be a huge success and you're standing up for yourself and you want this new beginning you are working hard for this new beginning and it's going to happen as we look at the second half of the week we have uh, the uh, the clive of, of, of pentacles and this is always the most uh, um, slow um, night that is coming in and you have the devil but yet still you end up with a good message from the fire sign which is this is this is extremely good so whatsoever is happening don't be alarmed about the devil because you have two very good um, energy vibration that is going on because you have um, the cliver of the Pentacles which is an extreme positive energy it's money coming towards you and he's looking towards you it's not that he's looking away if he's looking away then you have to pay but you know despite the energy of the devil you have these two knights that are here and these are very uh, two very good nights because the knight of Pentacles is very good because he's telling you that money is coming in it's coming in slowly but yet still it is coming Coming in and this cliver is bringing a celebration into your life so you know and, and and this cliver is opening new doors of opportunities for you so this is going to be extremely positive so no matter how you are looking at this situation um, no matter you know the energy of the devil is ending conflicts and ending situation and sometimes we need of negative people or um, being negative stuff to work out and to balance because sometimes we are positive the situation is negative and we meet negative people so with our positivity and the uh, opposite palladia of who you are you balance things and that's why the energy of justice in this week I can understand because you're moving away from something and this is very good okay it's wonderful it's very good the middle of the week the positive energy that is really governing all of your week it is uh, the heart element okay this is wonderful because this is the world and the world is uh, that whatever burdens that you have whatever that was holding you back it's no longer affecting you you're moving away from this situation you're coming out of that stagnant state that you were in and all the burdens that you were carrying you're no longer carrying them you're moving away you're clearing yourself you're feeling good about yourself you're releasing yourself and the energies and you know when the world crown a week and crowned a reading for a sign and you uh, Aquarius this is going to be extremely extremely positive I'm working with a conscious card because we need to be conscious. We need to have conscious endeavor around us. And let's see what the message from spirit, from the spirits of the conscious card wants to say. Before I go that they're saying that love is, that the focus of love is going to be, the focus of love is going to be, on Saturday and on Friday so beginning the weekend a lot of people are going to connect with other people um, a lot of I see a lot of people connecting meeting new people going out for a meal feeling good a lot of celebration is going to happen on on Friday but on Saturday it's as if you have calmed down and you're connecting with um, um, loved ones so love is going to be 
the most positive the whole week is all about business okay the whole week is all about business or you know if you're looking for um, student loan and that sort of a thing it's all about going out there trying to find something trying to make something of yourself but when it comes to love love is going to be extremely positive from Friday and Saturday on Sunday there's going to be a little eclipse in the love thing but don't be alarmed for work and business is going to be positive as you start the week with a positive energy you start the week with the earth energies and whenever the earth energies and the fire energies come in especially for you guys it is all a time of work and you're getting your financial situation in balance okay let's see what is here what this conscious spirit wants to say meditation so you guys need to meditate in this week I meditate daily to allow understanding the wisdom to flow through me so I meditate daily to allow um, the universe wisdom to flow through me it is so and it will be don't forget to say it is so and it will be so I meditate daily to allow the universal energies to flow through me and this is very very positive so here we are again we need to understand that certain aspect of ourself how we can um, manage certain aspect of ourselves so this is going to be a week for you guys that meditation is going to be a key in this week I'm also working with the oracles I don't know why but I love working with the oracles let's see what the oracles have for the Aquarians in this third week of July what does the oracle have oh my god oh wonderful because I've, 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 I've been looking at your energies and these are these are so 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 positive I swear this is so positive this is blessing for you Aquarians and this is just so wonderful because what is happening is that the blessings the things that are happening into your life see them as blessing good things are happening because you have the ace of Pentacles you have the world you have the the cliver of Pentacles so a lot of new blessings a lot of new situations a lot of new things are happening in your life which is so positive and so so you know blessings when blessings comes it's one of the most positive cards in this deck and I'm telling you this deck has you know it, it, it can get to the root it can makes you feel as if oh my god but it can also cheer you up I'm sorry I have to turn I'm looking for the energy of this book because it's a wonderful wonderful message blessings and I like to read the message in this book because um, what is happening is that there are positive situations that are happening around you in this week and this is going to be just so positive because when blessings come in it's going to be extremely 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 positive you know there are two energies that when they come in I'm like oh my god this is just so good okay blessings something wonderful that is unearned and unexpected grace that is an unforeseen gift from spirit so this is just super wonderful there are moments in life when out of the blue it seems as if everything has been orchestrated by divine intervention you're blessed in ways that are difficult to express it's as if um, the Red Sea parted in front of you and events come together and banish your troubles easily and naturally you know deep down you didn't not deserve any of this and yet here you are this is one of the times let ha gratitude for all of your blessing guide you now and this is so positive so expect if you know expect the unexpected this is a week where you expect the unexpected but it's good thing unexpected windfall and good fortune comes your way now you're in a place where anything any difficulties or obstacles that have been stimulating your growth to success seems to disappear on their own be ready to receive the windows of opportunities will open wide accept the blessing given to you now and don't forget to share them and this is what I've always said to people do not forget to share your blessings your blessings whenever you receive anything whenever the universe bless you with anything do not forget 
to say thank you to the universe because it is a reason why these things happen and why the universe bless people with wonderful messages and gifts you know and this is when unexpected things happen to you out of the blue someone comes up and says you know I know someone who is looking for someone that sort of a thing so if you're looking for work whatever your endeavor in this week it is going to be wonderful because you will have a, um, is a week of justice you have a week of meditation also and you have a blessing that is coming in so I want to say to each and every person please enjoy your week and um, listen to your Sun moon and rising sign thumbs up and share these videos namaste until next week